Do you sometimes feel like money is so unattainable that by all means you have to work thrice as hard as normal just to get the life that you desire? You wouldn't be the only one. But what if I told you that money is much easier to come by than you imagined? What if I told you that money is actually a flowing spiritual energy that you can tap into? What if I told you that the harder you try and the more you grind the less money you have, that's because money only goes where it is welcomed, with similar energy. It flows easily where there is no energy of struggle and survival. However, to do this, you will need to learn how to surrender and let go. If you're curious, you've come to the right place in this video. You'll learn how to transform your perspective on money and discover the magical art of tapping into its flowing spiritual energy. Keep watching to unlock the secret to attaining flowing wealth. If you're watching this video, chances are that you are stuck in something called the hustle mindset. Let's take a moment to dissect what that hustle mindset looks like. Constant busyness and the glorification of being busy. The belief that success and attaining money requires non-stop grinding measuring self-worth by productivity and achievements. The pressure to always do more, achieve more, and never pause. All of these might sound familiar to you, but while the hustle mindset is often celebrated, it comes with its own set of struggles and setbacks. Stress burnout and a feeling of never doing enough are also familiar companions. Have you ever noticed how our culture seems to glorify business? It's not just a personal choice. It's deeply embedded in the way we collectively define success. In the age of social media, success is often showcased as a highlight reel. We see people crushing it, achieving their goals, and constantly hustling the problem. We're comparing our behind-the-scenes with everyone else's highlight reel. The pressure to keep up can be overwhelming, pushing us into a perpetual state of hustle job insecurity and economic. Pressures add another layer to the hustle culture. The fear of falling behind or losing our financial stability can drive us to work excessively. It's a survival instinct, but it also perpetuates the never-ending cycle of hustle. At some point, you would have asked yourself, isn't there a better way? And you would be right to wonder that the answer lies in understanding the flow mindset and attaining the abundance mindset. So, what exactly is this flow mindset? It's like catching a wave, a state of alignment with the natural flow of life. Picture yourself floating down a river effortlessly carried by the current. That's the essence of the flow mindset. It's about surrendering and letting go of the need to control every aspect of your journey and instead being open to the realities and belief that success is yours by default. The flow mindset is also about embracing the present moment in a world that constantly pushes us to focus on the future or dwell on the past. This mindset encourages you to appreciate the now. And perhaps most importantly, the flow mindset involves trusting in the process of life. Trusting in this process means releasing the tight grip on your expectations and allowing life to unfold in its own often surprising ways, actually in more ways than one understanding the flow mindset helps you to achieve something called the abundance mindset. This is where your relationship with money as a flowing spiritual energy can truly grow and thrive and ultimately bring you the results that you desire. Attaining the abundance mindset when it comes to the abundance mindset, many are quick to dismiss it as a sham, some trendy buzzword that holds no weight. We'd like to invite you to a new perspective on that more than just a buzzword. It's a paradigm shift, a new way of seeing and interacting with the world. Imagine looking at life through a lens that sees possibilities instead of limitations and opportunities, instead of obstacles, that's the abundance mindset in action. How does it make a difference first? You start by seeing opportunities everywhere, unlike the scarcity mindset that fixates on lack. The abundance mindset sees a world brimming with opportunities. It's about training your mind to focus on the potential for growth, learning, and success in every situation. Next, you must see gratitude as a power tool. Gratitude is the secret source of the abundance mindset. It's not just about saying thanks. It's about cultivating a genuine appreciation for what you have right now. It's like a magnet for positive energy, like money, when you appreciate what you have. No, 
No matter how small you emit a frequency that resonates with abundance, cultivate a daily gratitude practice, acknowledging the positive aspects of your day, try journaling or gratitude piling, which is the practice of writing something you're grateful for every day on a note and storing it away for later. Reflection. This simple act shifts your focus from scarcity to abundance, inviting more reasons to be thankful into your life. Replace thoughts of lack with affirmations of ab abundance. By doing so, you open the door for prosperity to flow into your life effortlessly and as difficult as it may seem. You must learn to celebrate others. Success ever heard the phrase, a rising tide lifts all boats. That's the essence of the abundance mindset instead of viewing someone else's success as your failure. It celebrates the success of others understanding that there's more than enough success to go around. The truth is that you must break free from the scarcity mindset. The scarcity mindset is like living in a cramped room with no windows. It makes you believe that there's a limited supply of success and wealth, and if someone else gets a piece, there's less for you. The scarcity mindset plunges you into survival mode where every decision is based on fear and the belief that you must fight tooth and nail for every scrap of success. It's a constant battle and the casualties often include your peace of mind paired with scarcity. Is the hustle mindset a world that glorifies business equating it with success? It's the belief that to make it, you must... Work non-stop sacrificing your well-being for the elusive promise of a better tomorrow in this mindset. Wealth isn't attracted, it's chased. It's a frantic pursuit fueled by the fear of not having enough. The more you chase, the more it seems to slip through your fingers. But here's the truth. Money is attracted and it wants you to attract it as physics dictates. Like forces attract like forces and unlike forces repel each other. The universe is abundant, and money itself is an energy that you can and will call to yourself if your energy complements it. Shift from not enough to more than enough. Swap out phrases like I can't afford it with how can I afford it. This simple shift opens your mind to creative solutions and attracts abundance into your life. How to Surrender to Success This new reality invites you to surrender to let go of the need. To control every aspect of your journey, when you step into the flow state, you align with the natural rhythm of life, allowing opportunities and abundance to flow. To you, effortlessly, unlike the scarcity mindset which sees success as a limited resource, the abundance mindset acknowledges that the universe is inherently abundant. It's a birthright, and you don't need to fight for what is already meant to. Be yours in the world of abundance. Wealth is not chaste. It's attracted by cultivating a positive relationship with money and embracing the flow state. You become a magnet for financial abundance. Money comes to you when you're in sync with the natural flow of life. Are you intrigued? Stay tuned as we continue to unravel the secrets to attracting wealth effortlessly by surrendering to the flow state and stepping out of survival mode. It's time to rewrite your money story. Here are a few ways to let go and welcome the energy of wealth into your life. This is the art of surrender. Picture a river when you fight against the current. It's an uphill battle, an exhausting struggle. But when you surrender, allowing the water to guide you, suddenly the journey becomes effortless. Similarly, life has its natural flow and the more. You resist it. The more you'll find yourself battling against the current. Surrendering doesn't mean giving up. It's acknowledging that there's a larger force at play. It's about aligning your energy with the universe, trusting that the current will lead you to where you're meant to be in surrender. You find a profound strength, a harmony with the urban flow of life. First, it's time to release attachment to specific outcomes. How often do we set rigid expectations, convinced that success must unfold in a particular way? The truth is that life loves to surprise us. The flow mindset encourages releasing attachment to specific outcomes and instead embracing the beauty of uncertainty again. Releasing attachment doesn't mean abandoning goals or ambitions. It's about remaining open to different paths that might lead to the same destination.
It's understanding that the universe might have a grander plan for you than you could have ever imagined surrendering doesn't mean giving up. It's acknowledging that there's a larger force at play. It's about aligning your energy with the universe, trusting that the current will lead you to where you're meant to be. In surrender, you find a profound strength, a harmony with the EB and flow of life. First, it's time to release attachment to specific outcomes. How often do we set rigid expectations, convinced that success must unfold in a particular way? The truth is that life loves to surprise us. The flow mindset encourages releasing attachment to specific outcomes and instead embracing the beauty of uncertainty. Again, releasing attachment doesn't mean abandoning goals or ambitions. It's about remaining open to different paths that might lead to the same destination. It's understanding that the universe might have a grander plan for you than you could have ever imagined. This allows you to adapt, evolve, and find joy in the unexpected twists and turns of your journey. Next, you must cultivate a positive relationship with time. Sometimes it can feel like time is slipping through your fingers, leaving you in a perpetual race. Against the clock, it's a common sentiment in a world that often glorifies business. But what if time is not your enemy? Consider this. The universe has its own clock, a rhythm that orchestrates the unfolding of events in perfect harmony. Embracing the concept of divine timing means trusting that there's a right moment for everything. Your dreams, your goals, your success. Often we get caught up in the urgency of our desires pushing for things to happen on our timetable. But what if the universe in its infinite wisdom has a more opportune moment in store for us? Embracing divine timing is about releasing the pressure of immediacy and allowing events to unfold in their own often magical time. Of course, you must do what you must and show up when you should, but you should never battle against that. More importantly, you must master being present in the current moment in a world consumed by the past and future. The present often gets neglected, yet the real magic happens. In the now, being present means fully immersing yourself in the current moment appreciating the beauty and lessons it holds. Practice mindfulness, savoring each experience without the constant mental chatter about what's next, when you're present. You tap into the flow of life making decisions from a place of clarity and wisdom. It's a powerful way to align your actions with the natural rhythm of the universe. Now that we've explored the foundational elements of the scarcity and flow mindsets, Let's dive into the practical steps that will transform your relationship with money and harness its spiritual energy, one set clear intentions, and define financial goals aligned with your values. Money becomes a powerful spiritual force. When it aligns with your deepest values, take a moment to reflect on what truly matters to you. What are your core values? Now set financial goals that resonate with these values. Whether it's achieving financial freedom, contributing to a cause you believe in, or creating a life of experiences, let your goals be a reflection of your authentic self. When your financial journey aligns with your values, you tap into a wellspring of motivation and attract abundance effortlessly. 2. Creating a vision board for manifestation. Visualization is a potent tool for manifesting your desires. Create a vision board that vividly represents your financial goals and aspirations. Include images, quotes, and symbols that evoke the emotion associated with achieving those goals. Placing your vision board where you can see it daily serves as a constant reminder of your intentions. As you immerse yourself in this visual representation, you energetically align with the future you're working to create signaling to the universe your openness to receiving abundance. 3. Take inspired action, not forced action. The hustle mentality often pushes us into forced action doing things. Because we think we should, or because we're pressured by external factors, inspired action, on the other hand, arises from a place of alignment with your purpose and values. Pay attention to the actions that excite and energize you when you feel a sense of inspiration and joy. You're on the right path. Let go of the need to constantly be busy and instead focus on actions that align with your goals and bring genuine fulfillment for. 
Trust your intuition and inner guidance. Your intuition is a powerful compass on your journey to financial abundance. Tune into to your inner guidance, that subtle voice that nudges you in the right direction. It might be a gut feeling, an idea that won't let go, or a sense of peace when considering a decision. Trusting your intuition requires stillness and self-reflection. Create moments of quiet in your life to listen to that inner wisdom. As you follow your intuitive guidance, you'll find yourself on a path that unfolds with greater ease. And Grace 5. Surrounding yourself with like-minded individuals. Yes, money is energy, but so are we all and best believe it. Energy is contagious, therefore. Surrounding yourself with people who share your abundance mindset can amplify your manifestations. Seek out like-minded individuals who uplift and inspire you. Engage in communities both online and offline, where discussions revolve around abundance, growth, and positivity. And of course, hit the subscribe button for more shared energy creates a collective field of manifestation, making it easier for everyone in the group to attract abundance. Share your experiences, learn from others, and collectively elevate the energy of your financial journey. 6. Learning from Mentors Who Embody the Flow Mindset Mentorship is a powerful accelerant on the path to financial abundance. Identify mentors who embody the flow mindset. Individuals who have successfully navigated the balance between intention and surrender action and alignment learn from their experiences, listen to their insights, and observe their mindset mentors provide guidance, wisdom, and often a roadmap for your own journey. Their energy becomes a guiding force as you align with the flow of financial abundance. And while you work on all this, never forget that your greatest alley is yourself. Be open to the flowing spiritual energy that money is and watch it come to you. Like magic, if you enjoyed watching this video and would love to learn more about this, then make sure to like the video, share it, and subscribe for more. See you in the next one.